What's going on everyone and welcome or welcome back to the channel. It's Ian K. where this afternoon I'm over at Sonic America's Drive-In because it looks like it's going to be three times the fun with their latest promo. That's right and honestly this one is definitely looking right up my alley so stay tuned because the Big Dill Cheeseburger is up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. So could this be a fast food pickle lover's dream come true? Well guys, we're about to find out. Feast your eyes on the Big Dill Cheeseburger here at Sonic America's Drive-In. And as you're gonna see, we have got a lot of pickly saucy goodness to get into with this one. Let's break this one down real quick. All right, so right off the break, it looks like we've got a very nicely toasted brioche bun situation here, guys. Let's pop it and take a look underneath. And as you're gonna see, there is no shortage of their dilly ranch sauce along with some chopped lettuce. Looking pretty awesome. And as we pan down, you're going to notice more of that dilly ranch sauce along with crinkle cut pickle slices and crispy pickle fries, guys, actually made with dill pickles. A very lovely situation. So the triple threat of pickle goodness is all over this one. And that's all sitting on top of a 100% pure seasoned beef patty. And I got to say, guys, not bad in the overall presentation of that as well. There is a lot of crunchy goodness going on with this one, and I'm definitely digging it already. Underneath it, it looks like we've got a slice of melted American cheese for color and probably to help hold everything together. But guys, looking very awesome. And as you can see on the inside of this one, plenty of that dilly ranch sauce again this is looking pretty awesome so let's not waste any more time on this one this is the all-new big dill cheeseburger from sonic america's drive-in let's peep out this flavor oh yeah this is definitely right up my alley guys i mean the crinkle cut pickle slices alone along with that ranch sauce and of course some dill mixed in with that has got to be a beautiful thing but when you mix in the crispy pickle fries that is definitely the wild card i think on top of everything else here all right enough chit chat we're definitely getting down the business here we go guys the big dill cheeseburger from sonic america's drive-in let's peep this out Mmm. Mmm. Wow, they are not playing around, guys. That is a hearty situation when it comes to the pickle and ranch game on this one. And of course, that beef patty. I got everything in that bite, and I gotta say, it is absolutely delicious. Plenty of nice pickle flavor, the dill action as well. And of course, the juiciness and everything with that beef patty on the bottom is a very beautiful situation. This is pretty banging already. I had a feeling it was gonna be. Let's keep going in. Mmm. Yep, yep, yep. You're guaranteed to get some awesome dill ranch flavor with this one, guys, considering how much sauce is on this. This is really, really beautiful. And I have to say the overall mouthfeel is awesome. You get the acidity, the snap, and the crunch of the regular pickles on this. And naturally, the crispy goodness that's mixed in with it for variation is a very nice combination on top of that. And of course, with that beef patty, a lovely situation, all encased in a very beautifully toasted and soft brioche bun. This is definitely banging right now. Very delicious. And you know what? I love the fact that they're really focusing more on the pickle aspect of this. And you'd expect them to, considering it's the Big Dell Cheeseburger, right? But when you have three different variations of pickle goodness on this one here, you really want it to showcase big time, and it definitely does. There's plenty of each, but what I'm already seeing, and I wish there was more of them, are those crispy pickle fries. There's only about three or four on here to kind of go lengthwise across the burger itself there, so it's layered pretty nicely. But I think a few more of those would have gone a long way, but guys... This is really very flavorful. I love the fact that there's no tomato on this one. There's really nothing else you need. This really is a pickle showcase. Probably one of the best burgers Sonic has put out in a very long time. And coming from me, that usually is a hit or miss with them when I review them anyway, that's saying something. This is pretty good. Let's go for another couple of bites on this. Mmm. Yeah, that Dilly Ranch sauce is definitely banging on this, guys. I mean, it's got its own tartness and creaminess there, but when you combine that with the pickle flavor, everything is really, really super flavorful because of that. Again, I only wish there was a little bit more of those fried pickle pieces on here, but at the same time, I am totally digging what I got here. And on top of the burger patty itself, even though it's a little on the dry side as I'm getting further in here, there's so much moisture, I'm not minding that at all, guys. Still a very, very beautiful situation. The chopped lettuce, a little bit of a nuisance on this one. I would have loved to have had maybe a single leaf of lettuce on this one here, but even still, the showcase of all the pickle goodness is more than making up for what I'm having here, guys. This is really tasty. So yeah, very solid amount of pickle goodness on this one, guys. I mean, of course, starting off with the Dilly Ranch sauce, that's really the main thing on this. Of course, the sliced pickles right after that and the crispy pickle fries, just a lovely combination and a triple threat of pickle goodness. If you're this far into the review watching me do this right now, chances are you're more than interested to give this one a shot. I would highly recommend it. And like I said, coming from Sonic, this is actually a very, very cool, very delicious across the board. Let's go for one more bite. We'll wrap the review up with the rating coming up next. But guys, a very solid outing over here at Sonic. And I got to say, with all the pickle goodness, again, this is right in my alley. One more bite and we'll close it out. Hang on. 
You know, I really hope this is the start of a nice pickle trend in fast food because honestly, considering onion rings and regular french fries, mozzarella sticks, you never really see fried pickle chips from a fast food spot. And actually, I would love to see more of that action. Considering Sonic is really rocking with it right now, I am so glad that they're right out the gate with it. This is very well done. And I have to say overall, not a bad value with a little over five bucks for this. It's a mouthful and it's very tasty. So with that said, I'm gonna to have to give the all new Big Dill Cheeseburger here at Sonic an awesome nine out of 10. Guys, this was a beautiful situation across the board with the exception of the meat being a little on the dry side as I was getting into it. But like I said earlier, this is a showpiece for pickle goodness, guys. And that's the main reason you wanna give this one a go. The fact that it's on a piece of cheese I couldn't really taste is not really a huge deal breaker for me, but considering all the other robust flavors on this particular burger, this is easily one of my favorite ones over here at Sonic. And like I said earlier, with me also loving pickles and ranch anyway, of course this is gonna be pretty tasty unless that wasn't made right there's really no way that could have failed but guys very delicious across the board and an easy recommendation to try pretty nice all right so if you've made it even further into my review right now chances are like i said you're probably going to be giving this one a go so do me a quick favor drop those comments down below let me know what you thought of this one in particular and what did you think of the overall pickle flavor i mean was it strong enough for you because it was pretty nice across the board for me guys drop those comments down below and definitely let me know and with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for that next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. All right, Sonic, nice job on this one, nice job. But I gotta be real with you, I think you missed the boat by not pairing this one up with that pickle slushy. I mean, that was such a blast to check out a while back. How could you not bring that back to combo it with this burger? It would have been perfect. Still not too late though. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews, but just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.